welcome to the final day of the Trust Men, Trust Love Challenge. You are here and I am so ecstatic. Do you know how many people drop off the train, the love train, the love boat, and just quit? But you have not. You have showed up. You have dedicated yourself to this challenge. Maybe you missed a few days, but whatever. It doesn't matter because you are here and you have hung on and you have dedicated time to the most important person in your life, the most important person who's going to move you forward in love, and that is you. So loving you, honoring you, acknowledging you because we are on day five. And today is all about trusting life. So we have gone through the activation process. We have deepened into trusting ourselves, trusting men, trusting love. And now we're going to take it an even bigger bubble. We're going to take it to a whole new level of trust, which is trusting life. So today's mantra is everything is for me. Nothing is against me. Everything is for me. Nothing is against you. And just feel into that because there is something so powerful when we can go through life and love and all the hardships and the trauma and the pain and the grief and remember that what if everything that has happened to us is truly for us? And even when it feels like it's against us, it's not. It's either help, here to help us grow or it's here to help us feel even better. And I am a true testament to that in my own life, which is why I cannot wait. I cannot wait to have you on the most important training webinar of this entire challenge, which is happening today. And it is called, I'm going to look at my notes because I just had a brain fart, clear the clutter and surrender to feminine trust so that you can have it all. Clear the clutter and surrender to feminine trust so that you can have it all. I'm talking all. I'm talking self-love. I'm talking soulful relationships, that deep trust with men, with love, with yourself, and on top of it, meaningful success. How can you have just this rich, meaningful life? So let's have an even bigger conversation. Let's take it to the next level and I'm going to show you how you can do that. How you can really clear out all of this negative self-talk, these negative beliefs, this heaviness that is blocking you from all these circumstances that you've had in your life that are not your fault, but it's time to take responsibility as a powerful woman and to continue using those archetypes that we talked about in the first training day on challenge day one. Um, so how can they actually empower you to take responsibility in your own life, to take back your feminine power so that you can have it all. And that's how we're going to clear out the clutter and I'm going to show you how tonight and then how we can sink even deeper into this conversation on feminine surrender because it's freaking hard. We're going through life as women really in this old way of being, which is again, not our fault, but it's more the masculine way of doing, of pushing. And we've been taught to do that for very good reason for survival. And yet we are coming into this new day and age, this new level of healing that requires us as feminine leaders to really step into the scary thing, which is trusting this feminine part of ourselves, which is surrendering. And we're not going to just talk about that part of feminine power, which is very important and it tends to be the hardest, but we're not going to leave out the other parts um, that the feminine power archetypes can help us with, which is um, also having this playful element of our feminine spirit, this creativity, this ability to dream, and also the goddess part of our feminine power, which is just the permission to be, to bring people together, to have this nurturing side. So all these parts are very important. We're going to talk about how you can further continue to grow this level of trust within yourself, in life, with men, 
and in love so that you can truly have it all. And I'm doing that training today. So details are in this message. Make sure you are there. I really encourage you to show up live because it's going to be the most powerful way for you to really, really integrate what you've experienced during this five day journey. So many times we can drop off as I was mentioning, and we don't completely finish. And finishing is a way for you to commit to yourself, to tell the universe, I am ready for love, and also to show up and receive support from me, from the other women that join the webinar, to ask your questions, and to also learn a little bit more about if you're desiring to continue this journey with me, to learn about a beautiful program that I've put together. And I'm going to be sharing a little bit more about that. And it also includes a retreat here in California with me, which is really exciting. So I am really looking forward to seeing you today for the training and to be with you to complete this gorgeous process. The journey really never ends. I always tell people that on the day that I die, I hope that I am still learning the beautiful lesson of life and love and sinking my body and my spirit and my heart into what this life really means. And I want that for you too. And I know that you can have it. So thank you again for being part of this gorgeous experience with me. I hope you have loved it. And I can't wait to see you on the live training today so we can complete powerfully together. Yeah.